the Pilates Show, where we explore creative and innovative tips and techniques to help deepen the skill level of the movement educator while having fun. I'm your host, Anne Matee, and today we're going to take a look at kneeling chest expansion. Okay, so kneeling chest expansion, oftentimes we do it with both knees down, right? We can come onto the knees, face backwards, and do our arm arcs, right? Pressing, opening the chest. We can add the head moving if we want, work on breath, right? Lots of variations there. But to challenge, to create a little more challenge for an athlete, we're gonna come into a one knee stance, so like a lunge. So what I do is I put my forward foot on the headrest, which is flattened, and then I look for a 90 degree angle with both my legs. So in the front, in the knee, and then in the back is 90 degrees. So a person has to have pretty decent balance here because it's pretty narrow, right? So the wider they are, like if they have trouble with their balance, their foot could go wide and their knee could be wide, that's gonna be a lot easier. But we wanna challenge the hips and the glutes. So you're gonna get your client stable on there. And then here, there has to be a lot of squeezing in my right glute to hold myself really stable, drawing into the belly, keeping the waist really long. And then once I have that, I can start my chest expansion, any version you want, right? You can move the head or not, but holding myself in this position is actually a really a good amount of work for my hips and my back leg glute. So you change legs, and then if you want to advance it, you just bring this knee that's on the carriage closer to the headrest. So the tighter the lunge, the harder the balance is gonna be. So I have to work harder to keep my front right hip flexor open here, right? To, to stay really strong in the center. That's it for today. If you have an observation or a question you'd like answered on an upcoming episode, comment below or on our forum, Twitter, or Facebook. See you next time. Never stop learning.